Hello everyone, it's Carissa at Small and Scrappy here with you today. Um, I have a Mind Scrap unboxing. Uh, I haven't done one of these for a while, although I have still been getting the kits most months. Um, I've got a new filming setup with a... It's, I've got like a bendy camera arm. This is the first time I've used it properly, so um, I'm not too sure how this is going to go, um, but stick with it and um, I'll show you everything that comes in the... September kits. So I'll start with the papers from the main scrapbook kit to begin with um, and we have some lovely bright colours this month. Um, so this one, which I already have some plans for, is... Um, so it's from the Amy Tangerine Slice of Life collection and it's called The Universe. So we have this sort of speckled multicolour design here and then the rainbow chevrons here. Um, I'm planning to use this side. Um, I don't have any ideas for the photo yet but I sort of know what I want to do with the paper. <laughs> Next we have one from Heidi Swap Wolf Pack um, and they are large plain painted black circles on a background and I don't know if you can quite see on the camera but the background is actually sort of an old-fashioned map um, you can see there's some details there in um, sort of a sketched line and then on the back of that we have a wood grain uh, sort of distressed wood grain um, I think I'll use this side although I am quite taken by that map in the back of this side so we'll see and next we have looks like another uh, yes it's another Amy Tangerine slice of life so there's this sort of waffle square design here that's what it reminds me of anyway it might just be the colour um, and that's really bright and fun now on the back um, it's a pink background with like this sprinkles design on it. it is actually called sprinkle confetti um, and this just reminds me of donut icing so um, I'm not sure which side I'll use but they're both very fun very bright so the next paper is I believe this is yeah, a Chanel field trip one so we have this sort of um, splodgy black and white design here. Um, it sort of reminds me of an old fashioned school notebook. And then the branding strip's actually like a little ruler design, which is cool. And then on the other side, it's actually the cut apart. Um, and there are quite a few of these that I'm quite taken with. Um, I'm loving the dinosaurs in this collection. Um, so yeah, it might be a tough one that. Um, yeah, love the paper, and it's called Choose Adventure from Chanel's Field Trip. Next, we have another field trip paper which is called Seek Knowledge, um, and we have all these multicolored triangles on this side, and then the other side is sort of a, a blue grid design. Um, and again, I love this branding strip just multicolored polka dots. It's very fun. Next we have a paper from Coco Vanilla Studio, Boys Wall. We don't often get much CBS in the Mind the Scrap kits but we got a whole ton of it last month um, including the ephemera for this same collection. Um, so yeah I'm loving having something a little bit different. And on the back um, so it's almost black but it is sort of another wood grain um, I'm not sure if it would technically be but it is um, nice if you want something a bit more toned down um, and the paper is called Happy Go Lucky now our coloured card stock this month I love it's a nice bright yellow yellow is one of my favourite colours but it's not one I use in scrapbooking or even wear that often. <laughs> so, um, and so it's a smooth basil, and it's called Grapefruit Bliss. 
And then, as usual, we get our standard minus scrap black and the white, which is really good for mixed media. Nice heavy card stuff. Now, with the papers in the main scrapbook kit, we also got our alphabet this month. So these are thickers uh, called See the Good. I think they're from the Amy, Amy Tangerine collection. Um, they're quite similar to the ones in um, one of her previous collections. In, in that there's like a glittery and a shiny font. Um, and you do get the full alphabet of both, it's just the way they're displayed. Um, but yeah, I really like the glitter on this. I don't know if you can see, but there's kind of a few different colours in the glitter. And for our embellishments in the scrapbook kit, we have the 6x12 stickers from Chanel Field Trip. Um, these look lovely. I like that they're, um, they're matte as well, rather than shiny. Um, and again, dinosaurs is great. Mammoths. Um, there's a few photos which I know I'm going to be scrapping with this collection. I'm sure I'll end up buying a bit more. <laughs> Um, we also have the die cuts from Vicky Booten's uh, Wildflower and Honey, that's what it's called, the new collection. Really cute, lovelies. Um, there's a little honey jar in there which I think is adorable and it's, um, yeah, no, I I'm, I'm really like that. My only comment is, they are huge, look at the size of that flower. <laughs> um, so some of them might be quite um, showstoppery on a page, but um, there's certainly some very cute bits in there. Okay, next I'm going to show you the embellishment kit. Um, I'll start with the smallest packet. So these are the puffy stickers from Paige Evans' new collection, Truly Grateful. And we've got butterflies, and flowers, of course, I don't think there will ever be a Paige Evans collection without lots of those. Um, I love the little squirrel, he's adorable, and the bunny, they're just, they're really cute, and just, yeah. I always love puffy stickers, though. Um, and next we have another pack of die cuts, um, which is, again, something from the Amy Tangerine Slice of Life collection. Um, there are glitter pieces in there, and you know, you've got your standard cameras, bikes, um, frames, things like that. But I am super excited about these, and I was as soon as I saw the collection come out. That little doggy there, to me, I don't know if it's supposed to be, but to me, he looks like a corgi. And my boyfriend and I really, really want a corgi one day, so I absolutely love these die cuts in the collection as a whole. It's also got loads of other cute bits, as always. Um, I quite like this little camera and book stack with a few journaling elements in there. Um, yeah, no, really cute. And lastly, in the embellishment um, kit, we have more Truly Grateful from Paige Evans. And these are the um, puffy phrase stickers. Um, You've got things like Grateful, Adore Together, Make Your Own Magic. Um, again, all these butterfly and birds type elements, and um, they're not um, they're not quite as rainbow as Horizon, her previous collection. But there's still lots of like lovely bright colours, and there's a slight ombre to the words as well. I'm not sure if you can see that, but yeah, really excited to get using those. I love how they've they've filled all the gaps with just little dots of things, which is really cool as well. There's no space wasted on there. Last but not least, we have the mixed media kit. So this month we have a set of stamps. Um, again, this is from the Amy Tangerine collection, and we have bike, camera, um, little paw print. I love um, little cluster of hearts uh, and a few words and things. Um, so really like that. And to use with the stamps we got a letterpress ink. This is a green one. Uh, and another item from the Amy Tangerine Slice of Life collection. We got this washi tape. Now it's really wide and it's got the um, 
rainbow chevron design on it. They're sort of painted um, chevrons there. And last but not least, in the mixed media kit, we got some We Are Memory Keepers thread. Um, and this is in aqua. It does say it's multimedia thread and it looks a bit thicker than um, like normal cotton that you get on a reel. Um, you obviously get the bobbin as well, so you can use it straight on your sewing machine. I don't actually own a sewing machine, but um, I do really love the colour of this, so I'm going to try and make a point of using it as much as I can muster the patience for to do hand stitching. So everyone, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything I got in the September 2019 Mind Scrap Kits. Um, as I said, I've got a new filming set up, so hopefully if this works I'll be doing um, a few more videos. You know I say that every time, but um, you know, if you're interested to see what I create with the kits um, and see what I get in future kits, then please do subscribe. Um, like the video if you enjoyed seeing what I got and uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of um, the kits and all the new collections that we're getting and I'll see you next time. Bye!